Holger, straight sets, three sets, it doesn't matter. Whatever it takes to get the job done. Really yeah. good job today. Thank that you. second set, you, you had love 40 at 4 all, had a chance to maybe close it out, but uh, Alexi fought back hard. When he won that second set, how did you readjust to gain the momentum in the third? Yeah, it was uh, definitely not easy. He started to play well. Yeah. You know, in the important moments of, of the second set, I had those free break points where, you know, he made free big serves, so honestly not much to do, but I think I refocused very well, you know, went to the bathroom. Um, after that, came out on court strong, starting strong with some good returns, and, and then, you know, found the good energy and managed to, to keep that up in the third. Novak talked a little bit about it when, when sometimes he takes those bathroom breaks. He, he has a chat with himself, and he sort of talks to himself in, in the right way. What, what, what do you do in those moments to kind of get the mind right? Well, actually, I had to pee, <laughs> to be honest. You know what? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, to be honest, it was a two, two and a half hour first two sets, but, uh, uh, you know, I had to pee and then I took some water in the hair and went out again. So That's I, maybe yeah. the best answer I've yeah. gotten all week. How did you get ready for the third set? Well, when you, yeah, you got to pee, you got to pee. Be, you know. <laughs> <laughs> no, relaxed. <laughs> no, I, yeah, I mean, I, I started strong in the first, uh, third set. I had some break opportunities, yeah. managed to take it. Amazing crowd today, so I'm, I'm super happy. Hoko, you've been winning a lot of matches over the last several weeks on clay. Do you feel like you've, you've found your top level yet, or do you have more in the tank? Um, I'm, I'm feeling that I'm getting close to it. I okay. feel like that I'm you know, working on some things that are getting better each match. I still think I can do it more often in the matches, but again, it's getting closer and closer, and also... You know, I'm, I'm happy with my results so far in, in the clay season and it's, you know, leading up to French Open where I want to be the sharpest. So, yeah. you know, it's a good challenge against Novak tomorrow, as we yeah. talked about Novak, um, to, to see how I, how I am going into the French Open. All right, so you, br you brought him up. Six-time champ over here. You'll get your shot against him. You were phenomenal against him in the final of the Paris Masters last year. How will you try to repeat that performance? Wasn't he also six-time champion in Paris? You know what? I think it, it, he was, actually. Th that's, that's amazing. That's where the guy's head is at. I love that. <laughs> no, but of course, you know, it, it, it says itself. You know, he's an amazing player, one of the greatest we've ever had. And uh, I have to be at my best. So now I just have to recover physically and uh, try to play my best tennis tomorrow because that's what I have to do to beat him. And, uh, you know, he's also been showing better and better shape yeah. uh, in this tournament. So um, And also his goal, I guess, is to play his best tennis at the French Open. And, you know, this tournament is really an important tournament for every player, I think. So... You know, full power tomorrow, and, and let's see how it goes. How do you think the clay will play into this matchup? Because you guys have played at the U.S. Open, then in an indoor surface in Paris. This will be the first time. Yeah, there's a first time of everything, you know, and it's uh, yeah. it's uh, good to have uh, a first time against Novak on clay because you know he's I mean he's an amazing player on on every surface, but it's fun, you know, it's, it's a new challenge, and uh, you know he he likes it here in Rome, and and it's gonna make it even more tough. But again, I like big challenges, and tomorrow is gonna be one. All right, my man. Now tell us what's been what's been fueling you this week. Is it is it the pizza, the pasta? Give us some details, my man. Um, honestly, the pasta, okay. and you know the whole Italian vibe is great, man. I love it. You know, you know yeah. the the crowd is great. You know they have passion for the sport, and uh, you know I cannot wait for another firing match tomorrow. Well, you seem like one of those players. It doesn't matter if they're if they're if they're for you, they're against you. As long as they're passionate, you yeah. love it. Yeah, I think that's what matters. I think that's really. You know, fun to play. I said it many times now that I find it more fun to play with a crazy atmosphere than non-atmosphere. And, uh, you know, all my matches here has been crazy atmosphere in each different way. So, you know, I'm, uh, you know, I'm able to handle everything. Well, listen, Holger, you've been playing fantastic. We absolutely can't wait for Thank that you. next match. So get some rest and uh, bring the noise like you always do. Let's do it. Let's do it. Thank you, man.